Hey guys, this is Andrew with MyWatchAddiction.com and today, today is going to be a little bit fun. Today we're not going to take a look at watch. Today we're going to laugh. We're going to have a good time. And at the end of the video, I am going to show you guys how you guys can win one of my watches. Now, why are we doing this? Well, recently over the past week, I've hit some pretty, pretty big milestones for me personally and for the channel. So I want to celebrate that success with you guys because you guys are the ones that made it happen for me. I could not have done this without you guys. So I appreciate it and I just want to give back a little bit um, and uh, have some fun while doing it. So what are we going to talk about today? Today we're going to talk about the recent successes in the YouTube channel. We're going to talk about the history behind why this YouTube channel came about and the history of me and the watch collecting hobby. and then we're gonna watch some of the outtakes and bloopers of me actually trying to make this fucking channel for you because as much as you guys watch me sit down for five minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, whatever it may be, I've got a good 30 to 40 minutes of videotape behind each and every one of those because I suck at making videos. So that's what we're gonna do today. I hope you guys can stick around till the end and figure out how you guys can win one of my watches and you have fun along the way. So what are we going to celebrate? This week, uh, this week in 2018, we passed some pretty big milestones for the channel, in my opinion. Again, it's my channel, my opinion, that's the only one that counts right at this specific moment. So this week, we crossed 100 videos uploaded. Why is 100 videos uploaded so important to me? Because prior to starting this channel, I had one watch. One watch, it was a Citizen Navihawk that I had had for seven years and that's the only watch I wore before I got into this hobby. Two, what's the, the second milestone that we're crossing? Well, as of this week, we have now reached 1,000 subscribers. Why is that important? Because thanks to YouTube, they changed their monetization a little bit. So uh, the partner program that YouTube has for YouTube creators set some pretty high bars and I needed to get to a thousand uh, to make this channel viable. Three, over the past seven months, hopefully by the time that this video airs, we'll have reached 100,000 views. Now, that in and of itself blows my mind because quite honestly, when I first started this channel on July 22nd, 2017, I had no idea where this would go. I was bored one Saturday. I decided I wanted to get into the watch collecting hobby. I got some watches and I figured, you know what, might as well throw a friggin' camera over my shoulder and record the unboxing. Everybody and the brother seems to do unboxing videos, so why can't I? I'm not stupid, I know how to do this stuff. So I set up a camera and started recording. So my first video, July 22nd, 2017, was actually shot with an old ass Sony Handycam on a tripod over my shoulder, looking down at a blue sheet on a spare bed in the spare bedroom of my house. So the fact that that level and to reach 100,000 views with people watching my videos, people actually listening to me and listening to me talk blows my mind because as I've said over and over and over again in these videos, I'm a novice. I am new to this watch collecting hobby. I, in the grand scheme of things, when you look at all the knowledge that could be had about watches, I know nothing. So the fact that I've been able to generate enough traffic to this channel and have you guys actually listen to me uh, blows my mind. And the, the subscribers that have been w there with me from the start, I thank you guys because you guys are my rock. You guys are the ones that have stood by me through through all of it. So I, I really, really, really appreciate that. Going along with that, one thing that if you've watched any of my videos, 
at least once in every single one of my videos, I'm messing something up. Whether it's just talking in general, whether it's the name of the watch company, whether it is the name of a part on a watch, I'm guaranteed to mess something up. Because I'm doing this for fun, I'm not an expert. I'm just a regular guy that decided to throw a camera in front of myself and say, hey, why don't you guys take a look at these watches with me? It's a hobby. It's something to do. So the fact that we've been able to get this channel to where it is right now blows my mind and I thank each and every one of you. Now I talked a little bit about the fact that I mess up the name of watch companies. Let's see what I'm talking about. I, I'm gonna butcher the pronunciation of it. Uh, Maurice LaCroix was the Pronto S. Pronto, Marcus LaCroix. I'm gonna pronounce this wrong. Plungur? My Tassats. Zanto, Santo, however the hell you pronounce it. Blanchette that I was a vet that I received it. I go back and I look at those videos and I shake my head and I'm like, what in the hell were you thinking? You should have done some research. You, you should have asked somebody, how the fuck do you pronounce the name of this watch company? But I get a watch, I get it in, I get it on my desk and I'm excited to open that fucker up. I want to see what that watch looks like. I want that watch on my wrist and I want to see you guys. I want you guys to be able to see that excitement in my face when I open the watch and when I get it. I'm gonna mess up the name of watch companies in the future. There is no doubt in my mind, whether it's a Xanto, Santo, I don't give a fuck what it is. I'm gonna mess up the name of the watch company. It's part of the fun, it's part of the learning experience and, and I'm completely okay with that and I'm completely and 100% okay with you guys helping me. And I love that because that's how I learn. So if you guys want in the comments, We've seen it in the past few weeks. If somebody wants to talk shit in the comments and talk about everything I don't know, I love that. Do you guys know why? Because it helps me learn. It helps me get better. It helps me learn more about watches in general. And that is my sole purpose for having this channel. And that is my sole purpose for taking you guys along on this journey with me. <laughs> Going along with that, I may know something about a watch. I know that this is not a band. I know this is a bracelet. I know if this was in leather or nylon, this would be a strap and not a bracelet and not a band. I get it. But I get into my videos and I get so fucking excited about getting the watch and I get so excited about showing you guys the watch that I got. Do I remember? No, <laughs> not at all. So there's so many, so many times where I'll be recording a video and I'll know what I have to say I'll know the correct thing to say, but it doesn't come out. It doesn't come out of my mouth at all. So guess what? You guys get it. You guys get my watch addictions as it happens. Now, don't get me wrong. There is a buttload of times that I'll record the same video five, six, seven, eight times because I hate how it looks and I get so friggin' frustrated myself. This video right here, this video that I'm recording right now, I have started this video 15 times already. 15 times I've recorded this video right here and I'm not even talking about a watch. Not talking about a watch at all. So let's take a look at some of what happens when I get frustrated trying to record these videos. Eco drive. Um, this guy, opening this guy up and this video fucking sucks. Yeah, he is an Aragon, I'm sorry. Fuck me. Uh, on your way out, don't forget to watch up. So I brought it into the conclusion. Fuck you. This on my watch. Fuck you, active on. And they are somewhere all over the fucking screen right here. So deal with it. <clears throat> Take a look at any of our shit. You fucking suck. Right down there in the right hand corner is your Fuck you, you fucking mini grail as it relates to this watch. We're gonna not go with that because that sucks. If you stick around a little bit longer, promise me it won't be video that I can't fucking talk in. Yeah. The subscribe button, go ahead and smash that little fucker so you can watch me on into the future. For 2017, fuck you. Fuck, 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 fuck you. 17 December. 
What fucking order are you going in? See, it's, it's, I, I see these outtakes, I see these bloopers, and I laugh every single time I see it. I go back when I'm editing these videos and I watch what happens to me while I'm right in the middle of recording a video and how frustrated, how pissed off I get, and I just laugh. And I, I hope you guys had the ability to laugh at it as well. So here we are, we're at the end of the video. As I promised you, I am going to give away one of my watches. I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but I'll guarantee you it's gonna be a watch that I've reviewed on this channel already, um, and that it's a watch that I like and a company that I believe in. Uh, so you wanna find out how you can win one of my watches, it's very simple. We don't have any games. You don't have to go back and look through any of my past videos to see what watch I wore where. Nothing crazy like that. This is gonna be very, very simple. So, number one thing you have to do, you have to be a subscriber. So if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and smash that subscribe button down in the right-hand corner of that screen so you can follow us in the future. Number one, you have to be a subscriber. Number two, in the comments section down below, I want you to post up two things. Two things, very simple. What watch have I reviewed that you like the best and what watch would you like to see me review in the future? Very simple. What watch that I have reviewed that you guys like the best and what watch you guys would like me to review in the future? Two simple things. Your name, comment. I don't even care if you like this video. You like it, dislike it. You don't have to, it doesn't matter. You can still want one of my watches. In the comments section, be a subscriber, post up what watch I've reviewed that you like, what watch that you would like me to review in the future, and then, then probably right around, we're gonna give it a little bit of time so people can have time to, to watch this video and do this, probably around the beginning of April, um, what I'll do is I'll take all the comments in this, I'll throw them in a random generator, we'll do a video of it, throw them in a random generator, and we'll let it select one of you guys that commented in the section below to win one of my watches. So stick around, I don't have a specific date on that yet, I'm gonna say it's the beginning of April. I'll post up in one of my future videos coming up what the date is specifically, but guys, I do this stuff, I give this stuff away because I wanna thank you guys. I mean, I, seriously, from the bottom of my heart, I would not have gotten here from just a channel size standpoint without you guys watching these videos, and I appreciate it. Whether you hate me, whether you like me, it, it's all the same to me. At the end of the day, you guys watch the videos and I appreciate it. So I'm gonna thank each and every one of you, and this is the only way I know how is to give back to give away one of my watches to one of my subscribers. Anyway guys, thank you very much. I appreciate you guys sticking around with me today and sticking through uh, all of this video. I hope you guys had some laughs at my expense like I often do. And as always, if you wanna reach out to me, you can hit me up at mywatchaddictions.com. And if you wanna see what's on my wrist on a daily basis, head over to Instagram at Instagram slash watchaddictions.com and you will be able to see. Incidentally, today I'm rocking the Aragon Anti-Gravity. Haven't had a chance to wear this watch in a while, but still loving it. All right, guys, that's it. All there is to it. Hope you guys had some fun. Hope to see you guys in the future because I've got to tell you, take a look at this shelf. I have a lot of watches to take a look at you with coming up. We've got, right now, I've got probably 40 different watches waiting to be reviewed, waiting to uh, have you guys take a look at with me. So please stick around. Thank you guys. Have a great week.